got one hell on her, Jordan. Right there, there towards the barn. See it up there? See yeah, him there? I got him. Woo! That was it. Awesome. Good job. Good. All right, we had a pretty awesome stand. We had a couple coyotes get to howling. We actually only heard one howl back behind us after we let out a set of howls. But uh, you guys topped up on top of the hill and played some rabbit distress and one of them come right down there in front of us. Now we, as we were celebrating that, I spotted another one out there and I put a long shot on it. I know I hit it and it dropped, but I can't see it right now. I don't know if it got back up or what. But we'll go get our first coyote and then we'll go up and see if we can't find our second. Here's our first coyote. I'm guessing it's the male. Correct. Oh, boy's a pretty sucker. We woke up to a little dust in the snow this morning. I got hooked up with my buddy Jordan Kelsey back there behind the camera. He had this spot picked out, had a good wind for here, had a good crosswind left to right. And uh, we got to howling and had a coyote get to howling back at us, kind of back in behind us, right over our left shoulder. Got to look and sure enough, there was this male sitting up on top of the hill. We decided to switch to Eastern Cottontail Distress and man, it did the trick. He jumped right up, run right down here in front of us for about a hundred and, I don't know, 125 yard shot. Knocked him down, and uh, as we were celebrating that kill, we actually looked up and seen the mate was running off on the on the same hillside. We got it stopped out there and put a shot in on it. Looked like a good shot. The coat dropped just just stone cold there, but as we was making our way up there, it actually got up and run down into the thicket. We trailed it a little bit, but man, we got down there to brush piles and cows have churned up the snow and stuff, and we just lost the trail. We never did find that cow, but tell you what, we're pumped to get this one. I know we'll have another happy uh, cattle farmer.